This morning in Warner Springs, this weather balloon was launched on a journey that took it to the edge of outer space. It's part of science buff Bobby Russell's Quest for the Stars project aimed at getting local students sky high on science. I wanted to try to find a way to bring my love of aviation and science into my volunteering effort. And so Russell came up with an idea. Take this styrofoam box, load it up with cameras and GPS tracking devices, tie it to a helium-filled balloon and send it 100,000 feet into the stratosphere. We'll be able to see four to eight hundred miles of the curvature of the earth at that altitude. Russell will collect data to help students learn about environmental science, physics, chemistry. Well, the launch went off without a hitch, and right now we were expecting to show you the pictures Droid 1 sent back to Earth. But there's been a slight problem. On its descent, communication with the payload was temporarily lost. It was expected to land near Valley Center. Winds carried it to Marengo Valley, north of Palm Springs. So now the search for the balloon is taking place. A slight glitch in flight, but not enthusiasm for the project. We want to inspire students to reach for the stars and show them at a young age they can actually perform some pretty cool stuff as a high school student. Bobby Russell says he wants ditched class to watch the space shuttle launch. He's hopeful his enthusiasm for outer space is contagious. Artie Ojeda, NBC 739.